All right, so today I'm gonna to take a tour of Key Colony Beach. Let's go. Sadowski Causeway is the main road leading in to Key Colony Beach. Key Colony Beach speed limit is only 25 miles per an hour. So make sure you don't speed because there's always cars. Right off the right. causeway, you have a lot of little shops and uh, restaurants right here. And I'm going to take you through them. At the end of the causeway, you can basically go right or left, and we're gonna go right first and check out where like City Hall and the post office is, and one of the main parks. Here is the City Hall and the post office. The City Hall building is right at the end of the canal coming down Sadowski Causeway, and they made this cute um, little park here, and they have a pretty awesome view. I'll show it to you. Because of Hurricane Irma, the City Hall building is really not being used anymore. And um, they moved a lot of the offices um, over to these trailers over here, which I'm going to show you. Uh, the City of Key County Beach is working on creating a new building um, for the city. They're just getting ready for doing financing and finalizing the plans and whatnot. But just right over here, let me just Hold on, flip it around. They've got the building department, the city hall, which they're actually operating out of now, and the police department. All of which soon will be operating on the new building as soon as it gets built. Alright, next I'm going to show you where the golf course is, and the playground, the bocce balls, all that fun step stuff. It's right up um, 7th Street, so it's kind of just straight up from the um, post office and the city hall, which we're just at. So I'll be there in just a second. All right, so I made it over here by the park and the bocce ball um, courts. They're right over here. And back over that way, you can see that's where the golf course is. If I turn over here, um, over here, you can, I'm gonna walk over there. Over there used to be where the playground is. Um, but they took it down because they're going to put a new one and hopefully the new one has shade over it because it got really hot. Um, so I look forward to seeing what the city does there. So I walked over a little bit closer to where the playground was. So this is where you, it was and then you can see where like the swings and stuff are. And then behind the playground is the dog park. All right, so now I'm over in the dog park area and they just actually did this and you can kind of like look behind me. Um, this side is a little bit longer than the other side. The other side is kind of small. Um, they kind of just keep the doors open and let the dogs run through both sides if, you know, if they're friendly and whatnot. Um, it's nice to have. It's not the best dog park because there really isn't that much room, but I mean, I guess I'm glad that they, they put it in. So you have at least an option to bring your dog and socialize. Um, with other dogs here in Key Colony. And then just right over here is the basketball court. Um, nobody's on it right now because it's hot out and it's in the middle of the afternoon. So a lot of the houses in Key, Lo Key Colony are half duplexes. I'm just gonna walk down uh, 7th Street here, wait for this car to go by and kind of like show you. Um, flip it around, hold on. So right now I'm just walking down 7th Street 7th Street is really nice um, because it is across from the park and then a lot of the canals, or I'm sorry, a lot of the docks on 7th Street go um, perpendicular so you can get some big boats over here on this side. But you can see these are all half duplexes um, pretty much on this part of all right, so we're still by the golf course in those parks that I was just at by the playground and the bocce ball. But not too far from that is where all the pickleball courts are. 
and I know everybody wants to know about that. So here, I'm gonna show So you. these are the pickleball courts, and uh, if I haven't mentioned, it does get pretty competitive over here. Um, but they are very nice. And they have a little tiki right there for your shade and stuff. So uh, there's four different courts here and you can enjoy your time. Over there you can see is the tennis courts as well. Um, so pickleball and tennis are over here and where the basketball and the playground and stuff is on the other side. So. And then right by is where you get your golf clubs and sign up for that. So back that way is where the city hall was and the parks. And we're on West Ocean right now. And if I walk down, you can see like this whole street, this whole thing down here, this road um, is just basically condo, you know, condo lane, um, this whole left side because the ocean and the beach are right over there. So there's condo building after condo building. I think there's like maybe one single family in there, but this whole row is basically condos. We're gonna go to Sunset Beach next, but I just wanted to give you like a look down the streets. The streets in Key Colony, they're, they're super long. They're not short at all. It does take uh, a little bit of time to get down there. I had to walk back to my car to get to Sunset Beach because it's just too far. But I was just thinking, you know, like 7th, 8th, 9th, and 10th Street are basically half duplexes. And then when you get to like 11th, 12th, 13th, 14th, and 15th Street, that's where you get more of the single family homes. And then of course the West Ocean, which perils the water directly, um, is where all the condos are. All right, I'll see you at Sunset Beach. Hey, so we made it to Sunset Beach. Here we are. Um, I had to take the car because it would take forever. See how long, how far it is? It goes, goes you know, it goes pretty far back. Um, anyway, at Sunset Beach, you know, this is where they have all the concerts and things, um, live music during the winter season. It's also where everybody comes and gathers to watch the sunset because it's a great spot. There's no swimming at this beach, so you can't do that. And then also no fishing as well. They did just add bathrooms not too long ago, which is super nice. Um, and they've got lots of seating and a tiki hut there for some shade. And there's a community dog bowl for the dogs so they can get, you know, some water. So my selfie stick, um, you know, it broke, so I have to use my hands now, which is kind of a bummer, but you can see that the beach is super pretty. And uh, right now on the beach, there is this little Cuban vessel that came up. You can see it back there. Um, I actually landed in a different spot here in Key Colony, and I guess somebody moved it, and uh, you're not supposed to do that, so they're kind of um, gonna get in trouble. So if you see a Cuban vessel and it's on your property, don't move it, you're not allowed. Uh, you're gonna get in trouble. They do have this little sandy part right here, but like I said uh, earlier, there's no swimming at this beach, so try to respect that and don't do that. Go down 12th Street so you can kind of see the difference in the houses between the half duplex that I was showing you before and then the houses kind of over here. So just give me one minute. I'm only like 100 feet from the park and um, right by 12th Street. So you can already see that the houses and stuff over here are just a little bit different um, than obviously over on 7th, 8th, 9th where there's mostly half duplexes. So I'll just walk down a little bit more down 12th Street so you kind of get the idea of it. Um, you can see it's super quiet neighborhood. We really didn't see anybody, too many people out today usually you'll see them in the morning and in the evening right now it's like three o'clock um so they'll start to come come out as soon as uh you know the sun comes down a little bit and it gets a little bit cooler all right so now i'm going to take you over to the other side of the island i don't know if you remember when we first came off sadowski cause we went uh we went right now i'm going to go left um but I'm going to not drive with the phone on because it just, I don't think I can do that, okay? So I'll see you in a little bit. All right, so now I'm on the um, east side of the island and just kind of like the west side, if you look down the street, um, 
towards the ocean side those are all basically condos again and then on the other side is where you have the streets right behind me this is where the cabana club is you get a pool membership you can go there and swim and eat and then you have the havana jacks restaurant right over there and of course the glunt's um <clears throat> ocean beach hotel All right, so we're at the other end um, of East Ocean Drive, and I'm right behind, um, right behind me is Casa Clara. You can kind of see it back there. And if I look back, you can see, you know, again, all the condos are towards on the ocean side, and then you've got the streets on the other side of the road. And then also down here is a really cute, sweet little park, and I'm going to show you in just a second. So the park is on 2nd Street, so that's what I'm walking down right now. You can kind of see and right over here to the right and it's just a little play area for the kids and uh, tiki and a bench and things so super cute park you can see it's really well kept um, the playground over here is a, a little bit smaller usually than the other playground we'll see what the new one looks like but uh, here's the park um, so this is the one of the other parks they have here in Key County uh, for the other side of the island. All right, uh, so those are all the major spots here in Key Colony. And thanks for watching my tour. And if you have any questions about properties for sale here or any other things, get a hold of us. We'll talk to you soon. Bye.